What's good with y'all, man? Hey, you already know if you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that like, drop that sub, turn on the notice, because we're doing video daily. So, in honor of Throwback Thursday, man, all this Blade talk with Wesley Snipes, I thought I, I figured we, we'd do a throwback, man, of Blade, the official trailer number one. Can't believe this movie came out in 1998, bro. I feel old as hell. I was only eight years old when this movie came out. Uh, but yo, man, let's go ahead and jump into it. Let's get it. You better wake up. The world you live in is just a sugar-coated topic. There is another world beneath it. The real world. For thousands of years, they have existed among us. You keep your eyes open. They're everywhere. Chances are you've seen them yourself and didn't know it. A secret nation. Our livelihood depends on our ability to blend in. With a lust for power. We should be ruling the humans. These people are our food. They've got their claws into everything. Politics, finance, real estate. There's a war going on out there. He makes the weapons, I use them. <laughs> now, one will lead them to conquer mankind. Tonight, the age of man comes to an end. We're gonna be gods. And one will try to stop him dead. Worse things out tonight than vampires. Like what? Like me. <laughs> Half human. Blade's mother was attacked by a vampire while she was pregnant. Half immortal. You got the best of both worlds. All our strengths. None of our weaknesses. He is their greatest fear. And our only hope. It's open season on all vampires. Snipes, Stephen Dorff. You're one of them, aren't you? No, I'm something else. Blade. Hey. Yo, this trailer, bro, it just, it just took me back, man. Oh my gosh. It's so crazy how Blade 1 and 2 were so good. Blade Trinity was okay, man, but they really did try to turn that into a comedy. And, you know, as time goes on, I can understand why Wesley Snipes really wasn't happy with uh, David S. Goyer. I believe he was the guy that was directing the movie or whatever. Because um, they was trying to make it into a comedy and trying to make Blade the not even the main character in his own movie. So, I don't know, man. Listen. I still believe Wesley Snipes should get a send-off movie like, like Hugh Jackman did with Logan. Um, and it's so crazy. This trailer came out in 1998, man. This trailer came out that long ago, and the trailer was good. And the one thing I did notice in this in this trailer after re-watching it again, um, it, had, it had a little bit of comedy, and it had a serious tone. I've been saying this for a long time, man. Like Marvel, Marvel can have jokes and stuff in it. But man, bro, they could have the serious tone as well. And I think Blade did a good job of that. Because uh, Blade did have some funny things in it. I, after re-watching the trailer and thinking about uh, when I watched the movie a few times. There, there, There's a lot of funny things in the movie. But it also has that serious tone in it. Which, it's it's even playing field. Um, yeah, man. Dang. Yeah, I hope Wesley does get a send-off movie, man. I, he, he deserves it. I think us fans deserve it. And we all want it. I, I don't think I'm the only one, man. So, yeah. Post your comments down below. Let me know what you guys thought about Blade, the official trailer number one, man. Do you think Wesley Snipes should get his send-off movie? I think so. If you think so, let me know in the comments down below, man. I will catch you guys in the next one. 100,000 subscribers is grind time. Let's get it.